defended by Carter. And looking into the crystal ball, it's likely these teams will meet in the postseason. Who's going to stop them? I mean, I can only think of one, maybe two possibilities. Really? They can only stop themselves. And basket is good. Got it to go through the contact. So a free throw coming up. Opportunity for a three-point play. Really contrib... Let's it go from the wing, and she gets a jumper to drop. Perfect screen. They surprised to find herself so open. I mean, maybe that's why she missed. No good with the layup. And here comes the break. And they cash in when it's played. Pass to Magdagore. That's her second shot and her second bounce on offense. Knows when to look to score inside. Swish with it. Five on the clock. Hits it from three-point range. Who it is? That kind of D is going to cut it. Here in the first, with just under two and a half minutes played so far. Carter, that's good. How about that? Yeah, terrific little back and forth right there, Tim. It's been a lot of fun to watch. <laughs> Defended by Magdagore. And it's good with Magdagore. Off target with the jump hook. Now here's Swift. Boss defending. The three ball. Connects from three-point range. Looks getting looks like that from three-point range. Just nobody near her. Edwards grabs the miss. And they have certainly been looking locked in offensively. They sure have. Staying aggressive and playing in control. Launches a three. It's good for her second defense in warm-ups. <laughs> they need to close down on these threes. Harder misses. Defended by Carter. And the layup is good after a nice lead pass. Inside that freed her up and really just made that layup possible. They need this. And the layup is up and in. She's hit the ground right has put together a nice quarter offensively. The 11-footer, and she hits the jump shot. To the game, one for two. Fires from deep. Edwards grabs the miss. That shot off the mark. That's the kind of D that's needed when she's got the ball near the hoop. They were all over her. The three, good on the triple. Such a well-rounded offensive player. There's a screen. Defenders have backed off her. Over to the wing. Pass to Magbegor. The shot is good, and so is her shooting tonight. Three for four. But not letting the physical defense deter her. Magbegor plays. Stolen by Carter. 
Here's the break. And it's good. The game is all even. I mean, I'm not the deal. That shot missing. They hold the early advantage on the glass. Yeah, nothing major, but certainly a good sign for them going forward. Yeah, good omen. And count the awesome. basket. She Number was 10. fouled, and First she's going to the line for one more. Well, we're at the point of the season where you know what you have and know what to expect for the rest of the season. They're to a flying start. Yeah, we're seeing some high-octane offense from both sides. This is much watched basketball. Let's hope they keep it up. Achanwa, good. So smart in the pick-and-roll game. Achanwa adapts to the defense and makes... To the inside. To the paint. Shot clock at six. The three is up. Natalie Achanwa grabs the board. Her second shot and her second. And they have certainly been looking locked in offensively. They sure have, staying aggressive and playing in control. And she comes up with the deuce. Hey, look, if it ain't getting in the paint, and they keep scoring points. And you know, Brian, there's not really a lot you can do as a defense when they keep getting in the paint like they have been on this run. Gets it to go from downtown. I don't care how far from the bucket she is. You've got to have a defender on her. She's just too good from long range. Inside. Another shot. That shot, no good. That's the shot she had to take. No question. The decision was good. Just didn't execute. Just three on the clock, and it's good on the layup. To the inside. Number five. First person foul, team's first, first team foul. Checking in for the away team, number five, Olivia. Here's Carter. Offensive rebound. Jacks up a three, drains it from beyond the arc. She's made the most of her chances, has it? Goes on Magdalene. That's her first, first foul. foul team's first. first team foul. Right wing, six to shoot. From the arc, nailed from three-point land. Three in a row now. These defenders can't stay so soft on the perimeter. Pass to Carter, shoots the three. That shot's good, and she's now three for seven. Three's going down quickly at both ends. What an answer. You come at me with the three, I'm coming right back. Everybody gets a three. Here's Milic. He hasn't yet put up any points in this one. Uber boss. Milic no good. Two minutes now played in this second quarter. Takes a step back from about 10 feet out. Good on the jump shot. Outside Carter. All alone. No good there. And she continues to search for her rhythm. It's eluded her so far. That one is a sharp pass to set up the very high percentage shot in close. And I like the call. I thought the D was still moving. Yeah, it looked like it. And she kind of slid on her knees as she got to the spot, too. Substitution for your Huskies. Edwards. Arnold. Here's Carter. Eight points for her. Miles. Drops in the tray. They're getting a now Carter. This one for three. Doesn't go for her. And 
happened in this second quarter. A little under three and a half minutes played already. Snatched away. And here's the fast break. Finished off the break. Good work in the transition game. That's why when it's there, it's always a good idea to attack. to Milic. And she drops it in from the low post. Here's Carter. Miles. And she's good on the three ball. This is the four the last five makes coming from long range. Shot left block. Away team foul. First personal foul, teams first. And the first one at the line is good. At the line for your Huskies. Number 10. He's off on the second. That's something they need to do more of. Get after it on the glass. It certainly wouldn't hurt. Some extra possessions would definitely help narrow the gap. Chin of four, shooting 50%. Don't need much range to hit from that distance. Left side, Carter. Makes no mistake on the open jump shot. She is spoiling us today. Just another incredible assist for the highlight reel, and the reel is getting quite long. That one falls. Well, I'm a big fan of the fact that she's getting the touches she needs here after not scoring a point in the first quarter. And she banks in the layup. I'm not sure, really, Hunter there, and apparently neither did the defenders. To the paint. Here's Edwards. Magmagor grabs the miss. One item that stood out is their ball movement. Things are definitely clicking, and more importantly, it's tough to defend. Inside. Nice pass. Led him to the rack perfectly for the layup. Down to five on the shot clock. Over to the left wing. From downtown, can't get it to go. She's taken two and missed two. Well, Tim, they've only got a slight edge in rebounding, but it feels a lot bigger than that. The score has a lot to do with that. Their overall effort and execution have been superior. Those defenders. This is the most they've led by, 13 points. Second shot opportunity. The baseline, Jay, and the shot goes down. He got that ball right into her teammate's shooting pocket, and it yielded great results. To the inside. And the basket by Boss. And 10 of their last 12 into it. That is how you distribute the basketball. To the middle. Watson in the hoop for her third make from the field. She's three for four. They set a pick. Clock at six. The 11-footer can't get it done. It's her fifth miss and ten shots from the floor. To the paint. Here's Magbagor. It's good as five others before it were. She's now shooting six. Magbagor. The putback is no good. Yeah, she had an established position. And that's the call you want the rest to make in that situation. If there's any doubt at all, it should be a block. I agree. Give the offense the benefit of the doubt. From 12 feet out, yes, on the jump shot. Shot clock at five. Banked in off the glass. Would have cut it to single digits. 
It's a plus five advantage for them in the rebounding category after that one. And very steady work they've been doing on the interior, really. to this point. Pass to Carter. Miles. Seeks the triple. How many times have we seen a possession? I don't have an exact number for you, but I can tell you it's... We've seen it a lot. Okay, let's just say that. Strictly using assists as the measuring stick, they've been by far the better team. And she makes that one. The second she got around the pick and shook her man, it was straight to the bucket for the easy deuce. Very well done. Now here's Carter. 19 points in the game. And the three ball is good. Three for three. That's the way to start the second half. That one is good. She has missed only one of her six shots from the floor. These defenders look overmatched right now, especially inside. Well, they've given up 10 of the last 12 points from close range, so I'd have to agree. Now here's Carter. Miles bangs home the trifecta. It seems that every pass... Yeah, Six on the shot clock. Buries the long Got to keep an eye on her still. Pass to Carter. The screen by Magdagore. Oh. Achanwa, good. Achanwa. Plus eight in the rebound differential. Uh, one more reason they have absolutely just controlled this game. Yeah, double-digit advantage on the scoreboard. They've taken the initiative for sure. And it started out with the rebounding. It's set to tone. Third quarter of basketball here. A little under three and a half minutes gone now. No good with the triple. You can tell she thought that triple was going to fall. She's just shaking her head after that miss. Pass to Carter. Beyond the arc. Count it. With that bucket, she is now nine for 15 from the floor. Pointed to their second half total. They came out of the break dropping bombs and are just not letting up. You love to see that. Brady. They waste no time getting those three points. They don't want to send the line. And Shanwa is an excellent free throw shooter. Both teams deciding to change it up. And that one goes in. Two from the line that time. Goes up from the top of the key. Out to the wing. Takes the three. Drills it from outside. A big lead for them. Both. Tried to answer back, but that three is off the mark. To the inside. Marshall hits the layup after the sweet pump fake freezes the D. Pass to Milic. There's the three. Doesn't go that time. They had some botched coverage that turned into no coverage. And when she's open like that, you don't see her miss that sort of look very often. Back to Carter. Shot clock at six. Here's the three. 
Shot's good. Nice shorty. Plus his shot. Now Carter. 25 points in the game. There's a screen by Swish. Down low. The shot will not fall. Bodied her up and made her alter the trajectory of the shot that time. Definitely. Some very sound defense played on that trip down. Uh, Chanwa pulls it in. To the middle. Here's Marshall. The shot from the low post is good. That Carter. is... Defended by Carter. Shoots a three. Gets a three-pointer to fall. They can't afford to give her that kind of look. Well, it came off a good screen, but still, as a defender, you have to fight over the top of it. And you need some help as well. Down low. Oh. And she was... And thanks again for joining us. We'll see what happens in the fourth. To the paint. And they're going to count the bucket and send her to the line. It could be a three-point play. Interior. That's the kind of pass a coach loves to see. There's a screen by Swish to the inside. And she floats it in for the easy two. Credit the assist on that one. The second she got her... Whitcomb with the steal. Three on three. Here's Marshall. Here's the second effort. On the wing, Sammy Whitcomb. Goes back up, and the layup is good. Pretty much all of their bumming from inside the paint now. I mean, there's more holes in their defense than in a block of Swiss cheese. Man, you just made me hungry, but, but that's right. Five of their last six makes were in tight. They've established themselves inside. Where's the cheese? Five to shoot. There's the triple. Hands it from downtown. To the paint. And the layup is good. They're finding lanes to the hoop and buckets in a row from the paint. And on the flip side, the defenders have to show more fight on the interior. Or at least some fight. Here's Milich. To the middle. Beautiful dish, and the layup goes down. Good job, the great easy bucket. And here's Whitcomb. Just under two and a half minutes gone by now in the final. There's a screen. From 12 feet out, jump shot is good that time. And just about three minutes through the fourth and final quarter here. Launches it. That's a miss, her fifth, but she's made eight and shooting well tonight. Yes, it's good. That bucket takes... Wing shot on the way. That one goes. Count it. Sometimes the best play is to... Pass to Milic. Got it. Good job in the low post. Just really good awareness right there on the assist. And she uses the glass on the layup. All right, if they really mistake, uh, what's going on out there? Whitcomb defending. Puts up a three. That's a miss, and it's miss number two in shots from the floor. From about 19 feet. Yep, that one goes. And finds 
hits the bottom of the bucket from about 13 feet out. Risky shot there. Size-wise, height-wise, she easily comes out on the wrong side of that one-on-one -on -one matchup. Well, it was a nice, quick, high release, and that negated the height disadvantage she had there. It's rising bucket after bucket from long range. Patterson, an easy two points on the layup. There, Chris passing has opened things up offensively. Yeah, it makes the game easy. Ten straight points off of an assist. Um, that's impressive. Now here's Carter. Such a wide open look. They need to make her earn. Six on the shot clock. Down low. Let's it go from 11. And that one misses. She has made seven of her nine field goal attempts. Uses the glass to finish the layup. Well, they've built it. She's easily been the most consistent performer. No question about that. I mean, she's just hitting everything in sight. Get the rebound. Oh! And count it. Two points with a chance for one more at the line. Not enough bodies on the glass right there, and they paid for it. And it'll happen again if they don't put more effort into boxing out. And that's what it's all about, Brian. Rebounding. Effort. Outside, Carter. Shorty. Knocks down the three ball. She might not be the... Second chance shot. And the official whistle of foul on the shot. The bucket's good, and she'll go to the line. So both teams changing it up here. Carter with it. There's a screen by Swish. And it's going to be two free throws. Drew contact on the shot. It's on Swish. And the first one drops. And good on the second. Away team foul. Number three. First personal foul, team's first. Fourth team foul. First free throw is good. At the line for your Huskies. Number 35. That's also good, so she hits them both. Now here's Carter. Let's the three fly. Hits Number the three-point three bomb. Three. What a final quarter they're having. <laughs> And they've been really controlling this one. Never want to get too complacent, though. To the paint. Off on the layup. Lays it up and banks the opponent's building and dominate the way they did tonight. Says an awful lot about this team. Yeah, Blake, I guess they don't need home cooking, like you know, you're cooking from your mom, to feel at home. Just a masterful performance all around for them. That'll do it for our broadcast, everyone.